Martin to Grant. High post, it goes to Cooley. Back to Grant, left corner for three. Got it! Jaron Grant with the three in the Irish lead, 5-2. Back to Grant, four, three on the shot clock, two. Grant stops and pops and knocks it down, a three at the shot clock buzzer, and it's 8-2 Notre Dame. All right now to Cam B. who just came in, and to Garrick Sherman, who just came in. Sherman working on the block, fakes, goes up strong, gets it to go around five times around the rim and in and gets fouled. Who go to the line to attempt the three-point play after giving the Irish a 10-5 lead? Garrick Sherman has great patience when he catches the basketball in the low block, allowing that defense to collapse that 2-3 zone and finding open guys. Nice pass into the paint by Atkins to Sherman, who is fouled again, lays it up and in, and that puts Notre Dame back up by six. People are going to be really pleased with the play of Garrick Sherman. He's the one guy on this Notre Dame team who you can throw it to in the low block, and he'll make fantastic decisions with the basketball. Now it's Atkins ahead nice. to Sherman who lays it off to glass and in in transition. Pretty impressive for a big guy to get down the floor <laughs> that well, LaFonso, and that gives Notre Dame an 11 point lead and forces GW to call a timeout. How about that pass from Eric Atkins though, wow. Inbounds pass now to Grant up top to Cooley. Now it goes baseline to Grant for the flying slam, and it's 26-15, Notre Dame by 11. That ties their biggest lead of the game once again. Atkins on the right, it goes to Cam Beachide. Quick three, <laughs> knocks it down. They say he was towing the arc. As I said, he's ready. He's cocked and loaded at any time. Atkins with a basketball now to Connaughton. He shoots over it from a deep three-point position and knocks it down. Working on Smith on the dribble. Sherman gets into the paint. The jump hook is around the rim and in. Nice soft touch. Atkins between the circles. Atkins left side of the nice. lane. Nice pass to Sherman who lays it up and in again. Lane right side, it goes to Garrett Sherman. Sherman puts it on the floor, spins into the paint, loses the dribble, gets it back. I don't know, what what is that? He kind of just, he reached out and flicked it to the hoop. It went around the rim and in and it's 51-37. Extended Notre Dame's back in that 2-3 zone. His cross court pass stolen by Connaughton. Three on two break. Connaughton right side of the lane goes all the way to the hoops. The finger roll is up and good. The basket will count and Connaughton will go to the line because he was fouled. A blocking foul called on Joe McDonald. Every team needs a glue guy. Patrick Connaughton is that for Notre Dame. Does some of everything. You can shoot it from the perimeter. Rebounds well for you. He's a really good defender. Chroma driving right side, dribbles off his foot into the hands of Atkins. Atkins racing down the floor. Atkins shovels it to a flying Zach August who catches and dunks in one motion. And at 60-41, my colleague said earlier, he dunks everything and he just proved that. Comes to Larson, drives into the lane, blocked by Tom Knight. Crowley ahead to Beachide. All alone, he goes in for the flying Michael Jordan type slam. And the Fighting Irish win it tonight, 65-48.